What's going on gamers? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're about to go over how you can make millions of coins in Madden 23 very easy in the mindset you need when you are attacking these methods. If you're new to the channel, go ahead right now. It's free. Drop a thumbs up on the video, hit the red subscribe button, turn your notifications on, all that good stuff to fight the algorithm. And I will keep pumping out these Madden 23 methods, whether it's on the offensive side, the defensive side, or making coins. You will get it right here on the channel. Let's get into today's breakdown. LB, boom, come out here, look for work, and we should have either the cornerback or we should have a disengage. All right, so the number one and most important way to make coins in Madden 23 is your sets. Okay, on top of playing the game, your solos, leveling up, your sets is your best friend. That's where you're gonna be making most of your profit with the coins that you already have. Okay, so when you come over to sets, there's a few different sets that's gonna always be profitable that you can make an extra 45 to 75,000 coins every few hours okay you have the team builder sets that everyone knows about but then they also have the new alternative offensive playbook most of them playbooks is going between three thousand coins and thirty six hundred coins all you need for that is 274 overalls okay 274 overalls will give you a random alternate offensive playbook the 74 overalls you can catch them snipes for sometimes 400 coins to 600 coins okay so if you put two of them in and you get them for even the max amount 650 that's going to be about 1300 coins you're going to be making over a 14 to 1700 profit over and over now there's going to be people that undercut your playbooks still put your playbooks up so you can make at least a 1400 profit every single time that's going to add up if you plan solo battles if you plan just a regular head to head game and you have eight of these up at a time that's going to be an easy 12 to 13000 coins give yourself 35 to 40 minutes a day let them coins generate key to making coins is to be smart with your coins so don't go out and try to buy the newest and shiniest players unless you have somebody sellable on your team that you can replace so you look at your lineup if it's not B and D, that's when you want to spend coins on upgrades. So if you're going to spend 140,000 coins on a player, make sure that you can sell somebody and get 70 to 80,000 coins back. Now, also, sniping is at an all time high in Madden 23. OK, so if you want to generate a lot of coins in Madden, you got to be able to snipe. Now, I'm going to give you some sniping filters and you need to be watching Mutt GG for the best training prices so you can know what you should be buying the cards for so if 84 overalls right now with the training is going for about 24.8 thousand coins you want to be sniping for about 21 and a half thousand coins and below okay so if the 85s is currently on the marketplace going for about 36,000 coins you want to be trying to get a snipe for 35,000 coins and below okay so you can use that for each and every overall if you are saving 1500 to 2000 coins on each snipe when it comes to building sets like team builders and stuff that's going to help your overall profit okay so if a team builder is going for 35,000 coins and you are able to make it off of your snipes for about 25 27 thousand coins that's the gap in there after taxes that you want where you're going to be making 2500 profit to 5000 profit each and every time every time there is a new promo if you know about a new promo coming up 
Give yourself 24 hours to go out there and grind and snipe for an hour, hour and a half on the marketplace using these filters I'm about to show you right now. So if you go to the auction house, these are the key filters that I've been using to get all my bids so I can do re-rolls. Out of the re-rolls, I pulled the limited Ricky Williams, okay? So when I pulled that Ricky Williams, he was like 770,000 coins. That helped me out tremendously on top of leveling up in the game, which everybody know that gives you a lot of coins and head to head seasons. If you don't like to play online, that's okay too. Just do solo battles or something like that. But make sure that you are grinding your levels up. And when you are grinding your levels, don't worry about all the solos, worry about each and every objective that's how you're going to get max coins and that's how you're going to level up super fast but head to head is very good i just won the super bowl yesterday and in that super bowl out of the packs and the coins i made over five hundred thousand coins okay so if we go right here to the auction i like to go a e i o you you didn't heard that before so i would go a right here to my filters if i'm looking for 84s i will come right here 84 to 85 okay so this is unfiltered with the a's okay so i will go down to the positions i always do quarterback halfback wide receiver left outside linebacker free safety defensive tackle right in and strong safety i go a i go e i go i o u and then I go through and I look for different prices. Okay, so right now, 24,000, I can get 21,000 right there. Okay, so you need to check ahead of time to see what prices is good prices. 20,000 right there. Drop a thumbs up on the video. I'm showing you how you can get crazy snipes. Now, I don't need any snipes right now, but like I said, these is the filters that I usually go through to get all my great, great pulls. So 24,000 filtered on that one. So you have a 20,000 snipe already. That's going to save you probably two to three thousand coins already right there and then some of these if you get a nice snipe you can repost them all these snipes that you get for 20,000 19,000 18,000 17,000 and a new promo is coming not only are you getting very very cheap training for the re-rolls if that's the route that you want to take but also once the re-rolls come out training is going to shoot up so all these that you're getting for 20,600 19,600 17,000 all them great coin making snipes that you get in once the training rises up in price that same car you can sell for 33 34 35,000 and off of each one of them cards if you got 20 of them you're making about a three to five thousand profit off each and every snipe that you are getting in the game like i said all i do is go back and forth a e i o u if i'm not seeing any snipes on the a filter then i will go to the e usually you're going to find something very very cheap so 20,600 is what i'm finding right now train yourself not to go out chasing the newest shiniest players or trying to do what other people are doing make sure that you are getting your coins as high as possible after a while you will be having 2.5 3 million coins for any promo out there buy any card that you want limiteds you can rent them okay they go for 350,000 this year so if you want a new limited a new card that came out and he drops down to about 425 thousand coins you can buy him because after a while if you don't like them or you want to trade them you can still quick sell them for three hundred and fifty thousand coins same exact method i did with jalen hurts for my super bowl run now i'm about to show you how many coins you can make by winning the super bowl right now